In this video, we will see how to use a class. This is our main program. I'm going to add one class. Customer. Okay. Uh, we have to use a private instance. Private private string be the first time I'm just going to copy it and that's going to be phone phone and let's make it end okay so that's done now we need a uh, public member of this class public string and first name is going to be a get So that we need get and set. Okay, so in the get we'll return a value to a our public. Return first name. So you can do this way or if if you have a uh, same name in the constructor you will see so it's, you can even use this dot so it will be always use the public and in the set we'll say this dot first name is equal to value okay that is done I'm just going to copy it and paste here for uh, and this will be a int type and I'll say phone. The return is going to be a phone. The value will also be a form. Okay. You notice uh, when I have declared this private member, it starts with the lower case, and getter and setter I am using uppercase. Okay. So now basically you are done. You can even you can call from here. You can create a uh, object for this class. Or it's better to have a constructor. You must uh, pass the value through a constructor. Okay. Uh, so somewhere, this parenthesis is missing. It's morning about the parenthesis. Okay. And I'll just bring it down. Okay, that's good. Well, let's create the constructor. So constructor always start with the class name, and this is a public. T O M E O customer, and here can have a string is going to a first name and. It's going to be a phone. Okay. And here, what I'm going to do, the I will use a this first name equal to this first name. But now you see it's uh, the same name. It's just a confusion. Better I just 
remove this first and phone number I'll just add the phone number to make it a bit clear okay now first name equal to this first name will equal to that name will get and uh, it will be same with the phone phone equal to phone num okay and we go to class main class create object to create object class name and as you press the space it suggests the name as well for you it's customer equal to new and customer okay so as I open the parentheses it's asking I must apply a string and then int string is going to uh, let's put the phone number one two three four five six okay and i'm going to go here and just put a breakpoint here okay run a program uh expected okay put the colon f5 semicolon okay so you will see if phone number have abc and this uh, abc and phone number has one two three four five six as i press f10 now this name will initialize to this first name this public method okay now it's assigned there and phone number is still zero and now the phone number is assigned with the one two three and see the first name is assigned and phone number is assigned and then just go back to calling point that's how you just use a class and how you declare these uh, members okay there is another way if you don't have a constructor even still you can pass the value there send no problem uh, take two argument so what I will do I'll just clear create a class and now I'm going to use a customer dot you will see that first name that the public I can initialize it with the ABC and again the customer dot phone it can be one two three four five six uh, put the breakpoint uh, f5 Okay, because I don't have the constructor, maybe it's not uh, uh, using this uh, breakpoint. Uh, okay, but no problem. We can use a console. Control dot dot right line 
and I'm going to write the line customer dot 